my name is Asha Cunningham. I was born in Queens, raised in Brooklyn. I am a paralegal, that's my profession. I am the only child, and I'm here on the pier today where the story began. I know when I compliment her, she won't believe me. And it's so, it's so sad to think that she don't see what I see. But every time she asks me, do I? Hey, my name is Jermaine Bolton. I was born and raised in Jamaica, but I moved to live right here in New York. And I'm from a large family, large nuclear family, 10th out of 11 children. I'm a pretty easygoing person. I'm a guy who wears many hats. I'm a minister of religion. I'm also a recording artist. And actually, I actually work at the college as well, where I'm the programs coordinator for, you know, some, some kids, preparing them for the future. And um, yeah, this is where it all begins, New York City. That's where it all begins. New York, you know, one of my friends said to me, um, Jermaine, I have someone that you that I want you to meet. And I was like, what? You don't know how a virgin. Are you sure, man? Like, I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. She's a real pretty girl, man. I think she's the perfect match for you. And I was like, I was like, okay. So, you know, he gave he gave her number to me and you know, I, I called her and you know, we spoke like for the whole night. You know, we kept talking, 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 talking nonstop. I was like, man, this feels right. You know, she's like, she's really intelligent. Um, you know, she's telling me all about her job and you know, you know, all these kind of things, and we just have this very mature conversation. And you know, what really strikes me is like, you know, she talked about God. You know, you know, her church, her spiritual life was really intact. I was like, yo, man, you know, this is a girl, man. This is this is a, this, this is a person. It was like. I said to her, like, you know, could we meet tomorrow? And she's like, like nah, 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 we can't meet tomorrow. How about like at, at the end of the week? I was like, no, please. How about the other day? You know, and she was like, she was like, you know, at the end of the week, I was like, okay, okay. And I just couldn't wait. And, um, you know, that's what we meant. Our first date was actually here on the pier. Um, we had drinks over at the Dolphin, which is to the right of us. Um, we talked for a long time, for hours, and I remember that, you know, finally after we decided we were going to leave, I got a ticket. Thanks to Jermaine. Yeah, she got a ticket. Because <laughs> we didn't intend to stay that long. No. You know, so... But that's one thing with yeah. Jermaine and I is, um, once we start talking, we just can't stop. So... Um, it's just something that throughout our whole relationship we spend a lot of time on the phone. And you know, afterwards, um, like Jermaine said, we went to go to the movies and we watched the movie. And um, I just kind of had a feeling in my stomach um, that it was going to be the beginning of something very special. And that was our first date. My Ash, she's like so adventurous. Like, you know, if, you, if it doesn't have to be a holiday. It could be just like a Saturday or, you know, just like some random day when she has off from work. You know, we just, you know, she just, just bring over this schedule. You know, this is like jam packed. You know, from like seven in the morning um, to like 10 at night. You know, just all adventurous for the whole day. She was walking over to her folder and all this kind of thing like, you know, oh Jay, you know, we're, we're going to this this exquisite restaurant for breakfast. And then after that, we're going to go on some 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 boat tour or something like that. And after that, we're going to go to some spa or, you know, we're going to go to this museum. And it, it's just like all adventures, man. Like in front of my folders, by the way. Yeah, I do. Like, <laughs> in, in fact, nowadays, she don't really bring the folders so much. You know, she, she brings it electronically, but it's like awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Animation, baby. Animation. <laughs> um, Jermaine is amplified in everything that he does. Normal news that you would tell anyone. Like, um, so, babe, you know, for, for me, I guess for us in our relationship, I always get stuff for free. So I'm like, babe, I got something for you. You did? <laughs> and it's like... I'm always on the go. Just always on the go. Like, you know, sometimes I leave my keys, I leave my phone, you know, I leave my sunshades, you know, just like, because I'm just always going, you know, you know, oh, she says, I shouldn't say sunshades, I should say, um, say what? 
sunglasses. Sunglasses, yeah. I'm from Jamaica, man. I'm from Jamaica. <laughs> Come on. So, you know, so, I mean, like, you know, we'll be at a mall, and she's like, Jay, where's your phone? I'm like, whoa, where's my phone? And she's like, here it is, man. Here it is. I got it. All our giftings and our abilities just like just make it perfect. You know, we're just like a perfect match. You know, she's just a perfect person. She's a, that missing piece of the puzzle that makes her life very special. I just like, know she's a special one for me. She's a special one. I know it. I know it. <laughs> my birthday. Um, and um, Ash decided that she wanted to do something special for my birthday. And um, I said like, you know, she wanted to have like a a birthday dinner uh, with some of my very close, some, some of my closest friends and, uh, and family members. My my brothers came from Florida, and um, you know my friends from the area. And you know, it was like a very special um, night for me. I've been thinking about like you know popping the question. You know, from ever since it was like probably two months before, I was kind of like thinking about you know when should I pop the question, and, I, and then I thought like, why don't I just like you know pop the question right on this night. On her on my birthday and I was like I was like whoa she's she's my perfect gift so yeah so you know we, we gave wood favors that night and um, I actually like slipped the ring in, 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 in a bag and just insisted like you know that everybody needs to look in the favors like you know she included and I made sure that uh, that that so confused yeah I made sure that yeah she was so confused like I'm hosting this party like why should I why should I why, 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 why am I gonna get one of these favors, yeah. you know, why am I supposed to look in this bag? And I'm like, oh babe, just look in the bag for God's sakes. And she's like, she looked in the bag and she saw the ring. She was like, oh my God. She was like, she was so stunned. I was like, I took the question. And then like, you know, I, I got back into reality. I was like, man, this is like the happiest day of my life. This is the happiest day of my life. And you know, that was it, man. That was the engagement. This is how it, that's how it happened. Yeah. Her lips, her lips, I could kiss them all day if she'd let for the future, I would definitely, well, we're, right now we're in the midst of wedding planning and anyone that knows me knows I can't do anything else but wedding planning. Um, so In my ears, baby, do you like this color? Da -da -da. <laughs> <laughs> so we're trying to get our wedding together and uh, we decided on a date. We're getting married October 20th, 2017, so save the date. And, um, you know, we plan on getting married on the beach and um, with all our close friends and family members and I just know it's going to be the beginning of a journey um, together and I'm looking forward to what God has in store for us as a couple not only temporarily but also spiritually and do you have anything to say? Yeah, um, Ash loves children, I love children so looking forward to having some kids you know running around and um, and you know just building a family you know, the family is a basic unit of the society and, um, you know, it's God's way of procreating the world and, and you know, so we're just looking forward to building a strong home, a strong family and, you know, with God's help, we'll do it. I know it's not easy, like in these days, um, you know, just like the furthest thing from people's minds, but, you know, we want to be a, a, a couple of example that, you know, people could actually look, look up to and just, you know, you know, we just want to just live for God and just, you know, build a strong family. That's all. Yeah, that's for the future. I would change, cause you're amazing. Just